Hello everyone. I will be coming to you doing an art project. I kind of started this, um, but I'm going to come back and do it with you. This is an arrow I found at Dollar Tree, sorry. And uh, I don't know what this shape is, but anyway, I'm got, I connected the back. I put uh, glue. It's going to be hanging. And I'm also going to be painting it pink. You know, pretty much girls like pink. I don't. Um, but I'm going to put uh, at the top on the arrow, hello. It's like a mirror, but it has hello. And then this part is going to be beautiful. So it's going to say hello, beautiful. And like I said, the background is going to be pink. I'm going to be putting rhinestones on there. Or glitter. Whichever one. And painting this one. I haven't decided. Burgundy or blue. Hmm. The light blue, I think. That will be pretty. Kind of make it 3D, so I might need to get a smaller one or a board and put it on there. And... I also started this, oops, sorry, it's going to go like this, it's a shell. It comes in one of those uh, wind chimes that you get from um, Dollar Tree. It's a wind chime, you can take the middle out, but I went on and painted it gold. And then this, you get some of these, the flowers, or whatever you want to say they are. and. I was going to make an ornament out of it, so I was going to put it like this and paint the flower and put a hole somewhere or turn it to where the hole is at the top and make like an ornament. Also either put somebody's picture or their initials, so I'm going to do that with y'all. I'm also going to be decorating. I put this on my Bath and Body Works, yes. Finished decorating the glass. With y'all, it's blue. Um, making it for my cousin. My aunt, cousin. Anyway, she likes purple, so she wanted purple on there. And I guess blue for her husband. So, it's going to be blue. With purple rhinestones. And I'm also making her this because I suppose I had already sent it to her, but you know, everything's going on. Don't want to be out and all that stuff. And at the post office, it was crowded because people don't know how to stay six feet away. How, what's your opinion on that? Um, I put blue, they don't have the light blue to go with the glass. Um, they're supposed to be purple. But it looks pink, so I might take that off and just use uh, some of the purple that I have on the glass right here. I didn't hot glue it yet. I just stuck it on there, sticky on the back. I just wanted to see how it looked. And I got this from Dollar Tree. And the rhinestones. These I got from, I think, Walmart. But anyway, uh, it's in a big pack. So, I will be coming back, hot gluing it with you, um, putting purple on there. Like I said, this is purple, but it doesn't really look purple on here for some reason. Okay. Looks pink. So, that's what I'm going to be doing when I come back and we do an art project together. Um... Like I said, I'm going to be using these, the rhinestones. They have purple in there. Um, so I might be using a purple and a blue to put on the vase. Um, also, oh, where did it go? Uh-oh, I lost the part that goes on the glass. Oh, here it is. This is going to be either on the front of the glass or one of the glasses. It's made like this. 
and I'll put it in the center and then put purple rhinestones around it or making it like a bubble or something. So I'm not for sure how I'm going to do it. Let me know if y'all have any ideas. That'll help a lot too. So, like and subscribe, please. Let me, help me get more subscribers and and likes. And I had started this with y'all. I don't know if y'all looked at my other videos. But it's uh, from a cardboard. And I just put rhinestones. I might use these. It's, duh, this is light blue. Uh, but it's not the same color blue as the glass. But I put it on there. I got this. It was wrapped around something in a box. So I took it out. And I'm using it to be like an ornament or a centerpiece put a tea light right here I haven't finished it and you put a tea light right there I need to paint the flower um, like I said put glitter or rhinestones so if you got a tea light it reflects off of the rhinestones or the glitter so that would be very pretty and then I'm gonna paint the inside of it this color the metallic and I think I have some almost this color um, glitter. Sorry. I had to think. Sorry. Uh, this is ice blue metallic. And this came from Walmart. Sorry. This is ice blue. Came from Walmart. So I'm going to be painting the inside. And then... Hmm, nah, too much. I don't know what color to paint this on in, in the middle. Cause, uh, and then get a tea light and glue it. No, not glue it. Because I won't be able to change the battery. Hey. Um, get a tea light and put it right here. Or make something and put the tea, to stabilize the tea light. And it could just stand like this. Um, Or whatever you can think of to use it with but I'm that's what I'm gonna do it's gonna be um, probably in the center of my table for the holidays um, put a tea light in the middle of it so these are the, some of the pro these are some of the projects that I'm gonna be coming to you with so I hope you join me um, I hope you like it uh, please comment and like and let me know what you think should what should I put with it or would all of it be a good idea that I talked about um let's see what else I got plenty of flowers they come in a pack at Dollar Tree like I said I got my glue gun ready um, Um, I think I'm going to use these on the You're Beautiful. That way they can hang pictures on there. Either some right here or right here. And especially right here and right here. That way they can see themselves um, or whoever. And it says You're Beautiful. So... Um, I think I'm going to start on one side pink and that way you can see it but have the other side kind of already done that way we can go ahead and glue it because I, I don't want it to be too long of a video that y'all wouldn't stay with me to the end so I'm going to improvise so you, uh, I'm going to be using the this is from Walmart. The fruit punch pink to paint the arrow and the other shape <laughs> square and the hump. Uh, it's a gloss, outdoor indoor gloss. Uh, quick drying, easy cleanup. Um, like I said, it's the fruit punch, a pink color. 
that's what I'm gonna be using for that because I'm not for sure sorry you know a uh, cough drop I had lost my voice I'm not for sure if I'm gonna give it to somebody for Christmas like I said um, go to Dollar Tree they have all kind of stuff shapes um, butterflies um, ladybugs unicorns made out of wood um, it can be a family project you they pick out what they want you pick out what you want and you paint it they have paint there they have, like I said they have rhinestone they have glitter they have glitter they have uh, stickers so I did do a haul from Dollar Tree and I showed y'all some other stuff that they had there. They had the dream catcher. Oh, that was from Hobby Lobby, sorry. Um, but they had a dream catcher made out of wood. It was like a dollar or something like that. I haven't finished painting that one. Because I know um, I might make, I make dream catchers. But not like that one. I want to learn how to do that one. That's my next project. But I can make dream catchers. Small ones, big ones. Sorry. Got a message. Uh, I taught my mom how to make one. She took all my supplies. So I had to restock. Um, I've made them for co-workers. I've made them for my nieces and my kids. I made a huge one, small ones. Um, so, if you want me to uh, do uh, a video on making, sorry, this cough that was really strong. Um, dream catchers, lost my train of thought. Let me know. Uh, I got this from Dollar Tree. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, it's a bow in there, but you can use, like I said use it use it for an ornament um, It has the wind chime stuff in there. It has paint in there and everything it uh, Includes everything you need three pre pre printed wood pieces five strings one wooden bead three acrylic paints three aluminum tubes one paintbrush so you pretty much come with everything in there. The little round things to hold, you know, the wood chimes down. So if you plan on doing that, let the kids make whoever one chimes. And if you know anybody that like boats, uh, they have the she she seashell. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so embarrassed. Uh, they have the seashell wind chime. They had the big one. And then it, what is that? the small one, which I have right here. I painted gold for the holidays. Um, so you can paint it, come with the paintbrush, the paint, the one bead to, you know, center it. The round things to hold the wind chimes down so everything comes in all the packages I had got this this summer um, it, those are the wind chimes the little silver things I hadn't put anything together yet I was waiting to decide what I want to do with them I'm trying to see what else I have so but like comment uh, subscribe uh, Miss my mark it was my birthday today so I wanted to at least make um, a thousand or two thousand subscribers but I didn't oh well I have four <laughs> but anyway and I appreciate the four that I do have and some of the comments all the comments have been positive so sorry that have been positive and I appreciate that too. Um, continue to subscribe, subscribe and like. Um, let me know if you want me to do something 
and I'll find out how to do it and bring it to you. Um, also, let me see what else. Sorry, I, I look everywhere. I'm always doing that. Well, I hope y'all have a good night and happy birthday to me and every all the other Novembers. This month's almost over with. It's almost at the end of this, uh, I was going to say school year. Sorry, I'm so ready for the school year to end. Almost the end of the year. This year, y'all keep the faith. Continue to pray. If you pray, sorry, I, don't, I know not everybody. Um, stay safe. Um, it's getting ready to hit hard again, so uh, I pray for y'all. I pray for my family. Um, until next time, be safe. Like and subscribe.